Hello everyone and welcome to my let's play of Panzer Corps. We have the mission The Low Country is part of the Fall of Ice campaign, which stretches from 1939 to 1940, in case you all forgot what we were doing in the past several somethings. Time units. Um I'm Tomato, your host slash German General Meister, and I'm here to conquer everything. We're gonna go seize Calais. And I think that's actually all of our objectives. <laughs> but it doesn't matter, because we're going to keep seizing stuff. We're going to leave that Messerschmitt there. Fly our bomber. Actually. Over here. Not do anything just yet. get ourselves into barraging positions. Chill that AA gun. Surrenders. That's right, you Frenchy bastard. Stug has quickly become my favorite assault gun. I believe that's the correct term, assault gun. Yay! Oh, but they're artillery, so they can't seize places. Oh well. Burn. Well, there's really kind of no need to be charging around right now, like a maniac, but I enjoy it. So, let's go flying through the universe on a magical train called Adventure. I'm pretty sure that's the end of everything. But I'm going to keep bombarding. Just so that there's no possible hope of them ever staging a counterattack. And, um. With that, only four cities remain. One of them is French. It is Dunkirk. I should have seized Dunkirk somehow. And, um. see not much that I could have done that I haven't already. Um, I did not repair that stuka like I planned to. I see no air force remaining. I believe this may be it for the low countries. We're gonna see about their counterattack. Fire And it is a decisive victory. France has been crushed underneath our iron boots. And as always we will proceed to our scene where they tell us how much of a wonderful general I am, and then give us our next assignment. I really hope it's someplace balmy, like Hawaii, or I'll even take Britain. They have good ale there. Hope to God it's warmer than here. It's commanders such as Guardian, Rommel, and me leading our panzers forward. It's clear to see how such a daring plan has succeeded. Several occasions where your advance progressed so quickly, even high command lost track of your whereabouts. Whoops. Oh no, we went too fast. <laughs> we forgot to put down the telephone. The low countries overrun the British Expeditionary Force. France had to run away. British Expeditionary Force had to run away. France stands alone. Oh, do we get to take Paris? I want to take Paris. This is the moment Germany has waited 22 long years for, Herr General. We will triumph over our old enemies 
and erase from history their despicable Treaty of Versailles. Operation Fallroot is the final blow against France. Your objectives for this operation are several major cities and keyports. Thanks to the success of Falgelb, most of the French army has been demoralized, neutralized, or outright destroyed. So expect little resistance once you break through the enemy lines. High Command is almost certain that once you occupy Paris, the French will sue for peace. This makes it critical to thrust south as quickly as you can before such an armistice can take effect. This will increase the leverage we have in any negotiations, as well as enhance our own standing. Mm -hmm. So now we'll take a look at the map. Yes, more elite stuff! I think we have two of those things now. Panzer 3Fs. And all we have to do now is capture... This is. That's Paris, Le Havre, Cherbourg, Avranches, that's Caen, um, that would be Argentan, or Saint Lo. Saint Lo should be around here somewhere. Is this Saint Lo? Le Mans, Rennes, Drux, Orleans, Tours, there's a bomber school, that would be the bomber school. Um, Dijon, capture our mustard factory, Chatillon. Toyes, Chamond, Chalon, Sumon, Dreams, Noyon. All right. Hmm. So thanks to our success, we should have a relatively easy time pushing through here. So I'm gonna guess a three-pronged attack would be in order. One along the coast, one through the middle along this road, and one along this side. Oh, do I can keep auxiliary units? Oh, sweet. Get an auxiliary anti-tank gun. Auxiliator, auxiliary pioneers. Auxiliary AA. Auxiliary Stug. Ah, uh, yeah. Hmm. Alright, I, I might actually let you all look at my strategy performing process. Um. Special inside sneak peek preview. Alright, so we have a few thousand, so I'll go ahead and overstrength some units, understrength some others. Um, second Wehrmacht is going to get an Opal Blitz. I'm going to make sure, first of all, that all my infantry have at least some method of transportation now. Alright, good, they all do. I'm going to look for our most advanced elite units, which would be this light tank. These pioneers are going to get double overstrength. These guys get overstrength. I'm going to keep my pioneers as overstrength as possible because they are very helpful in breaking through random places. This artillery is going to be overstrength, as well as this other artillery. Overstrength artillery, I've heard, is very effective at breaking through things. And um, these guys will get overstrength. And um, with that, I think I'll save it right here and uh, look at it next time. Thanks for watching. Um, have a nice day.